Hey, what is going on, Amazon business owners and very soon to be Amazon business owners? Bob Schneck with All Go Online Retail checking in with you today on our new YouTube video. Super excited to be here. I just wanted to jump on and do a really quick video. I've been getting so many questions lately about Helium 10 and whether or not I use it, do I recommend it? And the answer is yes, uh, I do use it and I do recommend it. But I'm gonna kind of give you some pluses and minuses, kind of tell you why I use it. See, I am an absolute avid believer in Keepa. You've heard me do multiple videos on Keepa. I wouldn't even imagine trying to do a business on Amazon without Keepa, just because of the value of the information that I'm able to get, the historical perspective of what's going on. However, however, it does cost me money. It's not a lot. Uh, I think I spend 15 or $17 a month on my Keepa account, uh, priceless information. Now, when it comes to Helium, Helium is much more expensive. Uh, however, they do have a free Chrome extension. Now, the Chrome extension you can download onto your computer. It's very, very simple. Go to Google, search for Helium 10 uh, Chrome extension, uh, download it. It's a free account. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to use the free Chrome extension, okay? Because there is some actually really, really valuable information with the Chrome extension. So let me just go ahead and kind of, I'm going to jump onto my, my computer. Uh, I'm going to go live. So let me go ahead and share my screen quickly. All right, there we are. And then I'm going to go over. Let me see if I can get to it. Here we are. Uh, I'm going to pull up Amazon. Okay. So here we are in Amazon and I am going to go ahead and pull up up here in my right hand corner is where my Chrome extension actually exists. So let's just do, let's do something fun. This is all live. This is all off the cuff. So I'm going to come over here to best sellers. All right. And if you want to know what the best sellers are in all the different categories on Amazon, here you are. This is how you do it. You can see, you can pick whatever category you want. Uh, let's go into what would be fun today. Let's do kitchen and dining. Those are always great products. So here are the top 100 selling items, all right, in uh, the kitchen and dining category, if you were curious and interested. Now, once you've downloaded onto your uh, computer the Helium 10 extension, it automatically plugs certain things in. So let me just kind of walk through it. And what I'm talking about are these three lines that are up here at the very top of all of the top 100 products, okay? So you can see it tells you what the ASIN number is. It tells you who it's sold by. That one says not applicable. Right here it said sold by Amazon. So again, if you're just getting started on Amazon, uh, I'm gonna make a really strong suggestion. If Amazon is on the listing, uh, I would ignore it for right now, okay? There are ways to compete with Amazon. I've got other videos that talk about that, how to do that and everything. But this is a really quick way to kind of go through it. This one has sold by Amazon. It's got 12 sellers on it. Uh, this one is sold by FBA. That means Amazon's not on that, that it's an actual FBA seller. Uh, let's come down here and take a look. Again, sold by Amazon, FBA, FBA, 13 sellers, four sellers. So there's some cool things. Now let's just, I don't know, let's pick one of these. Let's pick, since we're, since we're heading into the, uh, the, the fall harvest canning season, look at what we got here. Here is ball, regular mouth, mason jar lids, 24 count. Now that's typically throughout the regular year, not actually in the top 100, but we're heading into that season. So it's a seasonal product that's made it in. This one has 34 sellers on it. So let's just go ahead and click on it. Now watch what happens. I'm gonna click on this and here's the listing, okay? You can see what it is. It shows you uh, what's going on with it, shows you who sells it, ships it. All right, now coming down here, you can see this first part right here. Here's the, the Inventory Labs logo right there, okay? And uh, it gives us some information. Now notice, I'm getting all of this for free. Now, if I go a little bit further down, here is my Keepa data. Now, Keepa, again, in my opinion, is absolutely priceless. It's only, what, 15, 17 a month. Uh, the information I get here historically is incredible, all right? But 
I want to focus on this. This is the Helium 10 Chrome extension free version. And the first thing I'm going to show you is it gives you right here, you can see the price. All right, that's right there, the blue line history. I've got a 30 day view up. I can switch it to 90 day. I can switch it to uh, one year. I can switch it to all time, but, but let's stick with 30 days. Okay. I can even go down to 24 hours, which is, is pretty, uh, pretty cool. All right, but let's go to 30 days. So we kind of get an idea. And what's nice about this is with, with, uh, with, with our keep a graph, um, I actually have to pay in order to get sales history. Okay. But as you can see right here, it gives me sales history, sales rank history, I should say. There it is right there. And why is that important? Because part, part of what we do when we do our analysis and research for products themselves is we want to get an understanding of the history of the sales rank. Because every once in a while, what will happen is people will just take a snapshot that day in time and it could have spiked, right? And meaning that the numbers jumped way up. So it doesn't look like there's a lot of sales going on. It could have dropped dramatically. But as you can see here, we have a pretty consistent run, at least for the last 30 days. Now, prior to that, the sales rank was higher, right? But now we're heading into the, uh, the canning season. And so it's kind of come down quite a bit. So again, I like this because it's free. All right. It also has some other interesting things attached to it. Here you have right here is a revenue calculator. All right. Now on this one, it can tell you uh, uh, fulfillment by merchant, what it would cost fees. It will tell you the FBA fees, right? These are all the fees that are included. Now here it says the selling price is $5 and 99 cents. Doesn't put in a product cost because that's what you and I have to do. Uh, the Amazon fees on this are 421. It breaks it down for you. Very, very cool. Uh, with a profit of 178, but you haven't worked in your cost, right? So my guess is on this one, it's probably, you know, uh, probably two bucks, maybe 225, okay, in terms of price. And once we, we do that, you can see that now it's a negative item. So again, great information right here. This is free. That's kind of why I like it. Now, I'm going to do a couple other things with this one, just to show you. I'm going to come up here to my Chrome extension. I'm going to get into my Helium. And it's got some different, uh, different records or different um, information that's available to us. So for example, if I hit x-ray, what it's gonna do, it's gonna tell me about that specific product that we're on. It tells us the total revenue for this one is uh, 273,000, the average BSR rank is nine, average price is 609. Remember when we were just looking at it, the snapshot was $5.99. We can come down here further, and we can see all sorts of valuable information, the number of sales over the last 30 days, FBA ranking, total revenue in the last 30 days, the BSR is nine, and if we want to do more research on it, we can figure that out. But again, a lot of great free information. All right, so let's go look at a couple of the other reports. All right, if we click on Helium 10, we can get into the profitability calculator, put all the information in, and again, I'm still a big believer that Amazon Revenue Calculator is, is the most accurate. However, when you're here, you're doing some fundamental basic research. This is actually pretty cool, all right? Uh, we can come over here. What else can we get in the free version? Let me just get out of that, come back up here. Let's see. We can also get inventory levels, how many are available. Now, what's nice about this is this one has uh, 35 different sellers. Okay. And as you can see from, from down here, 35 different sellers. And so what this does is it pulls up all 35 sellers, whoever it may be. Here's a brand, AAA essentials, uh, fulfillment either by, by uh, merchant or fulfillment by Amazon. Good information tells you what price the individual sellers are selling it for. It also tells you how much they have in stock. Now, again, that's a real important element. We're getting this information for free, which is kind of nice. Um, so again, there's another great uh, tool that you can use with Helium 10, the free version. Uh, let's come down here, reviews and insights. Now, the reviews are kind of important because it lets us know uh, what people think about the product. Now, as sellers ourselves, our, our personal uh, reviews aren't all that important. However, 
the reviews on the product are important. If we want to look at those reviews, we can click extract and it will actually bring up all the different orders. Now these are, I love ball lids, uh, but I ordered wide mouth, not regular. I don't need these. Uh, I will be returning them. Okay. So you can get a little bit of information on this and you can kind of see, and this is important as we're doing our product research. Okay. So, so those are some of the things that you get for free with the Helium 10 Chrome extension. Okay. I think it's absolutely awesome. Now, so let's go ahead and go back for a second. I'm going to come back over here. I'm going to head back over to this one. Now on this one right here, there's a bunch of features. Like I said, these three top lines right here tell you about the product from the Helium 10 perspective. Okay. So let me, let me do something else here. I'm going to see if I can pull this up. I'm going to click on this. Okay. Now watch what I do on this particular page. I'm going to hit the X-ray. And when I hit the X-ray button, it takes all of the products that are on this particular page and it does an analysis. Okay. And it starts to tell you this revenue for this page is $41 million. Okay. Now it shows you what they are, gives you the ASIN numbers. It shows you the category that Amazon has put it in. It tells you a little bit about who's winning the buy box. Now, this is actually an important one because a lot of times when Amazon's on the listing, we got to be careful, right? So really quickly, we can see on this particular one, the blender bottle, okay? This one here is, is, uh, is the buy box is being won by Amazon. So I would probably ignore that. This one by Greater Goods. I've actually competed with Greater Goods. So this, this report right here is a sort of a big, huge snapshot of everything that's happening, okay? Now, one of the other reports that's kind of cool, let's pick one here that I like. Uh, let's just go to one that is being sold, okay, by an individual. Okay, so on this one, uh, I'm gonna click on where it says sales. Now, watch this report, this is kind of cool. This gives you a trend line, okay? And you keep hearing me, I'm talking about all sorts of different things here today, but right now we are building up to the fourth quarter and look at what you see. Here's a trend line of what's happening with the sales of this particular product. Now, the truth of the matter is I could spend hours talking to you about all the benefits of what this actually does, uh, but I thought I'd do a really quick video and just give you my opinion. Yes, I pay for Keepa. Why? Because Keepa gives me invaluable information that I can't get from Helium 10 without buying their entire program, okay? Which happens to be really expensive. Uh, however, Helium 10 does have a, a free Chrome extension. I've shown you five or six things that the free Chrome extension does, okay? And I would highly recommend that you use it right? Uh, I think it's powerful. I think it's got some great information. And again, the more research, the more analysis we do, the less guessing we do, and the more success we're going to have. All right. So let, you know what? Let's do this. Um, I just want to wrap this thing up right now and just tell you, hey, there's a lot to learn about Amazon. Uh, there's a lot of tools out there. Some are good, some are bad, some are expensive, some are free. Uh, and, and that's what we do at Algo. We have a proven business model. Okay, our business model is not a secret like every other guru out there. Uh, we buy low, we sell high, and we sell name brand products. We do the research, we do the analysis, we don't guess, all right? We have system set up design. We have 6,600 uh, students around the globe that are using our program and our system, and I would love to teach you how to do it. Now, here's the thing. I don't do this very often, but I am doing a live webinar this, uh, this upcoming week. And I would like to personally invite you to attend. So if you've even been thinking about starting a business on Amazon and you want to learn how to do it the right way, you want to learn how to do it without all the secrets and the mysteries, uh, we call it the truth about selling on Amazon. Uh, I would absolutely love to, uh, to have you show up. I'd love to teach you how to do this. And one of my promises is I will show you step by step how to select a product and literally guarantee yourself sales the very first day your products go live. Now, wouldn't that be kind of cool? And again, it's not a recorded live. It is really live. And I spent about 90 minutes teaching you some amazing stuff, the truth about Amazon. And then I'll spend as much as an hour to an hour and a half uh, answering questions for people live. Uh, and that is the reason that I do do it live. So again, if you've enjoyed this video, if you've got any value out of it, do me a huge favor. 
click the link that says like, all right? It's really important that we know that you like what we're doing. Uh, subscribe to the channel because we're always putting out new videos with incredible content. And uh, if you'd like me to actually do a video about any subject at all dealing with Amazon, in the chat box down below, leave a comment. Okay, leave a comment, let me know what you wanna do. And I would be happy to do a video for you. Uh, again, my name is Bob Schneck, I'm with All Go Online Retail. Uh, very excited to be here, thank you for your time. Uh, register for our upcoming live webinar and I cannot wait to see you there. Take care.